hello students so see this question it's based on friction uh, we have got four blocks kept like this right the upper two blocks are connected by a string okay and uh, there's friction between these two blocks whose coefficient is mu there's also friction between these two blocks whose coefficient is again mu and the ground is smooth now we are pulling with a force f and we have to find the maximum value of f so that the blocks all move together without any relative sliding okay so the question is very easy see i have uh, taken the uh, four blocks again and this time i have numbered them one two three four right so i can draw the fbd of the system like this so the upper two blocks will be like this and the lower two blocks over here okay now we have got friction we are pulling this block forward so friction will act on this block in backward direction and over here in forward direction let's call this friction as f1 okay since this block is being pulled by friction f1 so this block will also pull the block 1 with due to the string now this block is also getting pulled forward so friction on this block will be acting backwards and its reaction will be acting over here forward so this is your fbd for the horizontal forces i am not drawing any of the vertical forces okay but we can understand now what is the maximum possible value of f1 so f1 will be less than equal to mu mg why the normal force at the bottom of this block is how much mg small mg okay so the maximum value will be mu mg same goes for f2 also f2 will also be less than equal to mu mg coefficient of friction is same on both the blocks okay now since we are pulling the system with a force f so the acceleration of the system will be how much f by 2m plus 2 capital m total mass of the system is 2m plus 2m and external force is f so this is the acceleration of the entire system moving together okay now let's draw the uh, let's write the equation for this block m2 so for block capital m2 this block right fbd will be what f2 is equal to ma correct f2 is equal to ma now we take a system like this we take these blocks together so on these blocks here f1 is acting like this okay see i have combined these two together so this is an internal force now so for this system for this whole system this f2 is an internal force and f1 is the external force so the external force f1 will give me what f1 will be equal to 2 times small m plus capital m multiplied by a now you look at f2 and f1 so f1 will always be more than f2 so i can write like this f2 is always less than f1 and f1 is less than equal to mu mg okay so i can just use this part i don't need f2 anymore so f1 is 2m plus m into a 2m plus capital m into a less than equal to mu mg correct now a is what acceleration is f by 2m plus m so 2m plus m acceleration is f by 2m plus 2 capital m that is less than equal to mu mg so from here i will get f should be less than equal to mu mg i take 2 common m plus m divided by 2m plus m this is your answer for the question